Okay, um... We are back, so... Let's go and... What do I want to do? Oh yeah, I wanted to go up to the Fairy Airy. And then... Also need to go down to Phenomenon for that character, because I need another character for going down there. <clears throat> uh, after which, I'll figure out what to do. Right now I'm going to go grab this little sparkly, the ore that's over here, and then we'll go up to the dungeon. In the dungeon there should be at least one more chest that was not accessible to us previously, but should be accessible to us now that we have the, like, the newer monsters and whatnot. Or now that the monsters have all been updated. But yeah, looking at the two new Yakuza dev games, I, I think I'm more interested in Judge Eyes than Fist of the North Star, to be honest. I am sure I'll play both of them. I mean, I know I'm going to play Judge Eyes. That game just looks fun as hell. Uh, I love the role that Kimura Takia is playing in that game. I think he is fantastic in that style of role. So I'm definitely going to be playing that. What I need to decide is whether I want to get the Japanese edition that comes out December 12th or whether I want to wait until the North American release comes next year. And then as for Fist of the North Star, I... Honestly, I'm not sure. I ain't going the wrong way here, too. Um, yeah, I did. Mainly because it comes out right after Cold Steel 4. So I don't know what I'm going to do there. I'll have to decide. And Fist of North Star was cool. The demo we played, but... It, it's... I don't know. Judge Eyes seems way more appealing to me. I'll figure something out. Regardless, um, Cold Steel 4, will, when it comes out, it will be the priority on the channel until it is basically 100% complete. So maybe I'll do something where I start doing daytime streams or something and take the daytime stream for you know, Fist in North Star and other games like that. We will see. We will see. For now, we have this to play. In about three days, three or four days, the DLC for Xenoblade Chronicles 2 comes out. So that's going to be awesome, too. Looking forward to that. Again, not sure what I'm going to do when that comes out, because I am no doubt not going to be finished with this by that time. Now, the new monster should be in here. I, I you know, come in here expecting for the, there to be a new monster for us to ride, but... I'm not going to lie, I'm not 100% sure whether or not it's actually here. We will find out. If it's not, it's no big time loss. So far, I'm not seeing it. I need one of these, though. Let's see, how much MP do you recover? Is that 5 MP? Quite a bit of damage, though.
I have to go up all this way anyways to find the monster. Because it's more towards the end of the arena, or of the dungeon. Arena. At the very least, we're getting some pretty good items. Did that thing just try to fire that at me? Oh, I fell right on it. I mean, I'd run too, but you scared? Seriously, Rab? See there? Oh, no, I opened that chest. Uh. Huh, not yet. Really? Hmm. So the monster we're after is still not here yet. Well, okay then. Just go over to the Metal Academy since that's the quickest way. And we'll start heading down south. If a non non. You know, I wonder, how did the Metal Academy not suffer any damage? I mean, we have an explanation for, uh, what was it, anger law or whatever? But how did the Metal Academy not suffer any damage? No use getting the horse since it won't let us take it past this point, anyways. Uh, here we go. <laughs> that man is in danger. We must go to his aid. <laughs> You want to carry those claws home in a bag? <laughs> well, don't say I didn't warn you. You really sound like a monster. Silvando, darling, you were fabulous. So fierce. Fierce doesn't even begin to describe it. You were ferocious. <laughs> Can it be? Can it truly, truly be? Truly, truly, truly? It is. I think it really is. 
Darling, it's so wonderful to see you. Oh, I thought you were lost to me forever. Um, <laughs> you two are acquainted? And uh, w w what is it that you do, exactly? <laughs> oh, come now. Isn't it obvious? We're fighting an epic battle to bring back something the world has lost. <laughs> it's smile! That's right, darlings. We're on a quest to bring sunshine and laughter back to every corner of this drab, drab world. My little parade has picked up quite the cavalcade of warriors for wondrousness. Aren't they just so much fun? But never mind that now. I can't believe you're alive. It's a miracle. I thought I'd never see you again. E excuse me? Oh, honey, I'm so sorry I forgot all about you. Are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? No, no, I am not. Thanks to you. You are more strong than you appear. My name is Da. I come from Phnom in the south. And if it were not for your help, I would not be returning there. Thank you. Oh, you're heading home. Then we'd better go with you. Can't have you getting attacked again now, can we? Hmm? Listen, darling, you and me have got a lot to talk about. So what do you say you join the parade for a little while, huh? Come on. You know you want to. We oh, have yay! to, by the way. I'm so excited. Okay, time for you to take your first steps as a soldier of the Smile Spreading Special Forces. Here, put these on. This is a thing. No. You look even more adorable than I thought you would. So proud. All right, boys. Let's make our newest recruit feel right at home. He's an old friend of mine, after all. Yeah! <laughs> Lead on, darling! And don't let me cut you frowning. You're at the head of the world's premier gladness-bringing parade! All right! Let's get out there and make the world smile! Oh, and Shammy. Sorry. Yeah. I think Greg should be forced to wear this as well. Yeah, and this is a thing. We're actually doing this. Yep. Come on. Man, you slow. take these things off soon though this uh, outfit here is necessary for the quest that we got that uh, requires us to get our charm up to a certain um, level their hero because this is one of the highest charm increasing uh, pieces of equipment we're gonna get for the hero Destination, the beautiful, bustling tourist town of Nom Nom. Bustling, yeah. Uh, not here, too. Uh, the whole world is just so dreary these days. Um. 
Thank you for saving me. I... I must go now. I wonder what can have made him venture so far from home in the first place. Might it have something to do with why the town is so quiet? Hmm. Sounds like a job for Sylph's detective agency. Leave this to me. Agents of happiness, soldiers of smile, go spread some special parade cheer and find out what's going on around here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to work! <laughs> Why can I not shake the feeling that Silvando and I have met somewhere before? I don't know. Why is that, Hindi? Why is that? Let's take this off and get this back on. This is what I wanted, right? Yeah, um... What does this give anyways besides the appearance change? It's pretty darn good stats, but I am not gonna wear that. That's just not happening. What do you have to say? Oh, yes. They're scared of something, and we are going to help them with their problems, because that's what we do. Oh, and there is the side quest up there. Do you have any new equipment now? You do. pretty close to the time where it might be, you know, good to drop the swords we currently have on the hero. Charm and attack. Hmm, these have agility instead of charm, and I kind of like that. But they're just not that much better than what we're using, so I'm gonna just save my money. Let's see if we can't accept this quest here. Rainbow Rock Salt. Laguna di Gondolia. Grotta della Fonte. Okay, uh. That's over by Gondolia, isn't it? We can't quite get there yet. Do we have, do we have that? Already? I guess we don't. No, okay. Well, we have to wait until we get access to the boat again to be able to do that. Once we have access to the boat, we can Duh, do that quest. You are okay. You are not hurt. Oh, what a relief. I was fearing the worst for you, especially after little son has gone missing, you know. Your boy is missing? Oh, honey. Ugh. Where that selfish child chooses to go is none of my concern. Heartless. You must forgive him. 
His wife died recently, you know, and now his son has gone missing. It is very hard for him. Do you know of the monster Avarith? She appeared in the village with her foul friends soon after Yggdrasil fell and the darkness came. We were paralyzed with fear and could not run away. Then she gathered us all in the square. Give me your valuables, she said. Tell me what is most precious to you. I will protect it. People were so scared, they obeyed her without thinking. They gave her money, husbands, wives, even children. But the wicked creature lied to us. She did not protect the things we gave to her. No, she took them and ran away. Oh, that's just awful. Oh, if there's one thing I hate, it's dirty, rotten liars. Don't worry, honey. We're gonna get all your stuff back. All of it. Really? But Avarith is very strong, very powerful. Oh, it'll take more than a common thief to stop me. I won't let you down. You know what they say. A knight's word is his bond. A knight? Hmm. Avarith went south with everything she stole. She has a lair there, I think. Then let's get after her! We've got an evildoer to punish! Let's do it. Uh, this boss is the exact... Well, yeah, boss. Spoilers, boss coming up. Is the reason I decided to go grab Rab first. Uh, when I played this in the Japanese version, I accidentally did not go do that. And you get locked into doing this quest before you can do anything else. And I got locked into it. So I couldn't go get another healer, and I was stuck with three characters. It was incredibly difficult. Uh, but now it shouldn't be as bad since we have a healer on our party. Who actually happens to be able to do magic damage, which is another good thing. What is going on? Well, let's go rest at this uh, campsite over here. Wonder if all the guys are gonna be here. Oh man, they're not all here. I was kind of hoping like all his little friends, his little smile band or whatever it's called, would be here. Let's save this. Now it's raining. After all that time I spent trying to get it to rain. Wow! Your parade looks fun! Where are you going? Hi there, little one! We're just off to hunt down the horrible, nasty monster who's been kidnapping people from the village. Is your father named Da, by any chance? Hmm. So you were not abducted. And what are you doing in such a dangerous place? Your father is worried about you. <clears throat> my father does not care for me. He cares for my mother's necklace more than anything else. He told the monster so. I thought he would say I was the most precious thing to him. It made me very sad. So I decided to follow the monster and get the necklace back for him. Then he will see that I am worth something. But then I strayed too far from the village and became scared. So I stopped here to hide. What your father said was upsetting, I am sure. But this is no place for a child. 
Come, we will return you to the village. No! If you are going after the monster, I am coming with you. I have to get my mother's necklace back! That seems like a really bad idea. <sighs> oh, don't be such a spoil sport, Hendrik! We'll look after the little darling. And besides, he'll be safer with us than out here on his own. Very well. But the boy is your responsibility. Thank you! Thank you! I will be useful to you, I promise! The monster went that way. There is a cave on the cape where she is hiding. You heard him, everybody! Let's go teach that dirty bandit a lesson! Like how he says, that way, but then point. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty obvious where it is, but it's just kind of funny. He went that way. Wh which way? Is that way exactly? There's our, our monster right there. You fiend! You are going to give back what you've taken and let all the people of the village go. And you are going to do it now. <laughs> <laughs> so that is why you are here. You humans and your heroic nonsense. Still, I suppose you have shown a lot of courage coming here. Very well. Let's say I do give everything back. It's not going to happen for free. You're going to have to give me something to sweeten the deal. Hmm. How about your most valued possession? That seems like a fair trade, wouldn't you say? Nope. Wait. If you wish to make a deal, fiend, you must make it with me. I have something for you. Something soft and warm and fragrant. Something I just know you are going to love. Oh, what is it? What is it? It sounds amazing! I have to see it right now! Hand it over! Hand it over! With pleasure! I do hope it brings you joy. Let me see! Let me see! Ugh! What is that awful smell? You! You! Do you think this is some kind of joke? Oh, don't you like it, honey? I chose it especially for you! <laughs> oh! You'll pay for this! Avarice will not be mocked by a silly, dumb up little human! You just were, buddy. <laughs> Maybe this will teach you a lesson! <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. For mercy. Your lives are mine now, and I'm not giving them back. Oh, I forgot about that. So we can't cast spells. 
Um, hmm. But what we can cast is this. Oh, and I just now realized he can't use his resurrection with claws. Oh man, we can't have him as a claw user. I was thinking we could, but nope, we can't do that. Let's go crit. That, that's not critting. Uh, mm, that's not good. Not good at all. We also can't use our single target heal this way. Um, we'll shoot. We may very well lose this battle. have to survive until the silence wears off. Oh, that's that's not good at all. Oh, silence wore off, but we are asleep. Thank you. Ow. Oh, and we're silencing in. Oh, hey, it wore off on him, though. Lucky. Multi heal. We have not done yet. Okay, so he's still silenced. Um. Let's do Falcon Slash. Actually, I wonder. He's a. Is he a dragon? <laughs> Might be worth checking if we can do Dragon Slash, see if that deals good damage, because he might be a dragon. Let's try it. Let's do Dragon Slash. <laughs> Okay, so he is a dragon. Hmm. <laughs> no, don't buff yourself immediately. No! Darn it. Oh well. I just need to do regular attacks with the hero and just hope for crits. Ooh! The miss! I like it. Try this for size! Uh. 
Oh man, that was some good damage there. Ooh. Oh, okay, well, it's just Hendrick. I don't care about that. All right, that was so much easier than when I played it on the Japanese version. Oh, the extra party member is such is make night and day, just night and day. What you get for being a nasty, greedy girl. Everybody, are you okay? You are not hurt. <sighs> we are fine, thanks to you, our brave little son. Avarith only kept us prisoner, she did not hurt us. <laughs> you saved us. I... I do not know how to thank you. Fair maiden, a smile will more than suffice. <laughs> Here it is! My mother's necklace! Take this back to my father. It will only make him more sad. Oh, of course it won't, you silly boy. Didn't your daddy ever tell you it's the thought that counts? It could be smashed to pieces and you'd still be his little hero. <sighs> All right, time to take Son and the others back to the village in style. Come, darlings, your parade awaits. You take your time, honey. We'll be having all kinds of fun. Ciao for now. Okay. I think this is something we got earlier. Yeah, there's nothing there. I really don't think there's anything. Just a grab in here. Nope. 
Okay. Uh, um. Wait, was it saying I can grab? Oh, I can start working my way up this way, can't I? Okay, so I mean, it was worth a shot, but we have to we have to abandon this whole claw thing on him, I think. Pretty sure that's what we have to do. I also remember there being a spell up here I really wanted as well. Oh well. I didn't realize that I wouldn't be able to cast um, the 100% the res while he was using claws. I guess I... I don't know. I should have realized that. I just didn't really think that that was going to cause him to not um, be able to use that ability. I didn't think it was locked to a weapon. Actually, I'll do all that once I get Silvando back in the party. We'll do like a big setup, you know, go over everybody's skill trees. I, I'm still thinking about whether I want to switch up. Uh, Hendrick as well, and just make him back to a uh, axe and shield user. I mean, he was doing some fantastic damage on that last fight, but he has a pretty sweet ability in his axes that allows him to deal damage and put a uh, defensive debuff on the enemy. Hello, Father. I brought Mother's necklace back from the lair of the beast for you. But it... it is broken. You... you did what? Foolish child! <sighs> Hmm? Huh? You... You could have been killed. And then where would I be? Hmm? Without you, my most treasured possession. <laughs> said that Mother's necklace was your most treasured possession. I said it, but I did not mean it. How could I? Don't you see? I did not trust the monster, so I said a lie. I lied because I wanted to protect you. But really I... I thought you did not care about me. I... I'm so sorry. You must have been so worried. Man, the acting on that crying is... really I bad. It was all but a misunderstanding. If only he and his father had simply been honest with one another. Yes, if only. <clears throat> I'll see you both outside, okay? Ah, 
father. These are my new friends. They are the ones who rescued everybody. <sighs> I cannot thank you enough. You are true heroes. <clears throat> the first time we met, when you rescued me, I was searching for some. But I had to pretend that I did not care, in case the monster came back and realized that I had lied. I hope you understand. Hmm? Hmm? Huh? Where is my friend with the feathers? I wanted to say thank you. Sylvando left for us suddenly. Perhaps we should go and look for him. Either... Maybe he went up towards the mural. That's what he did. <sighs> if only he and his father had simply been honest with one another. <gasps> ah, you scared me! How long have you been standing there? Ah, never mind. It, it was nice to see Son reunited with his father, huh? But. There are some who will never be reunited with their loved ones. Some bridges that will never be repaired. Can I ask you something? Mordegon is... he's super powerful, right? Powerful enough to destroy our world. You've seen that power for yourself, but you still want to fight him, don't you? Uh-huh. You really are a hero, huh? No, I'm the main character. Of course I am. You know, I thought it was enough, traveling the world, trying to put smiles back on people's faces. But what good is a smile here and there if the Lord of Shadows could snatch it away at any moment? What I'm saying is, I have to leave my beloved parade and come with you. It's the only way. I uh, support this decision. But there's something I want you to help me with first. It's all well and good me going and getting my head squished by Mordegon, but I can't do that to my darling boys. So we have to leave them somewhere safe, with somebody who can look after them. Now, I know just the place and just the person, but... Well, there's no good way of saying this. I'm petrified of seeing him. So you have to come with me. You will, won't you, darling? Yeah. Oh, thank I'll you. you buddy. I knew you'd say yes. Okay, I'm going to go break the news to my little soldiers of smile. Meet me outside the village, all right? Mm -hmm. We have to do this. It's we if we don't do this, we can't continue the game, so it is mandatory. Just a 
Darlings, I have an announcement to make. My parading days are over. No! Oh, the reaction to that. Ah, 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 ah. But do not fear. It will only be for a little while. I will return as soon as the Lord of Shadows is defeated. We... we understand, Sylve. That Mordigan's stolen enough smiles. Someone's got to stop him. Yeah, you go and do what you gotta do, Sylve. We'll be heartbroken without you, of course, but we'll survive. And if anyone can show that rotten spoil sport what's what, it's you. <sighs> exactly. We'll never get those smiles back if I don't do this. And I won't be leaving you high and dry. I'm going to ask my papi to look after you in Puerto Valor. Puerto Valor? Wait. Surely not. Surely you cannot be Don Rodrigo's. So you finally figured it out, huh? Same old stone-headed Hendrik. Such a sweet, simple boy. Oh! <laughs> All right, my little champions of cheer. Let's go show Puerto Valor how to party! Yeah! <laughs> I cannot fathom it. The boy is unrecognizable, and he has abandoned the name his father gave him. Don Rodrigo must be furious. <clears throat> Forgive me for my lack of composure. This has all come as quite a shock. Oh, uh, yeah? Uh, yeah, that's pretty obvious. Silvando is none other than the son and heir of Don Rodrigo, the noblest and most revered of all knights. It was always assumed that he would follow in his father's footsteps. But the two had a terrible argument, and the boy left Puerto Valor never to return. Until now. <clears throat> but perhaps this is not such a bad thing. I have been meaning to visit Don Rodrigo and seek his counsel. Very well. It is not far from here to Puerto Valor, the road will take us north and then east. Come, let us follow the parade. Oh man, don't sound so enthusiastic, Hendrik. Let's go over to this campsite and then we'll head south from here.
so strange. I thought I'd never see this place again, and yet here I am. Well, at least I came back with a bang. You go on ahead, honey. I need a second to compose myself. Don Rodrigo, it is I, Hendrik. It has been too long. Uh, huh? Hendrik? Ho <laughs> ho How many years has it been since you completed your training, huh? Eh? Come closer, caballero. <laughs> Let me see your face. I have heard many tales of your exploits. <laughs> to think that the great lump of meat who came to me all those years ago is now the hero of Eliador. <laughs> I had not expected to find you in such good spirits, my lord. As one who owes everything to your kind offices, it pleases me greatly. Alas, there has been precious little cause for mirth since last we met. Dundrasil fell, then Yggdrasil, and now the Lord of Shadows roams the land. Don Rodrigo and I have much to discuss. Perhaps you could go and fetch Silvando while we talk. Yeah, because we don't get him. He's not coming. But first, let's, uh... Raid your stuff here. Anything else? Okay. Let's go get old Silvando. Where'd he go? Uh -oh. By the beach.